Hello, in this video, I will consolidate knowledge from previous lessons on the correct use of white balance. Here's my first photo. I will make the image warmer. Then I will compile the current edit into an external LUT. I turn it off for now. The second LUT will make the picture colder. I will make blue colors darker using volume tool. Now I'm choosing masked alt mode, turning on the external LUT and creating a mask based on image warmth. Let's turn on the mask preview. My external LUT affects black areas on the preview. These areas will be warmer. I'll adjust the mask and that's what happened. Here is a photo before and here is after. Let's try another image. I will not darken blue colors here. I will make cold colors even colder, for example like this. The effect of the external LUT can also be strengthened. This is how the diagram with the program tools looks. Now I'm going to swap the external and current LUTs. Thus, cold edit will be in the external LUT and warm edit will be loaded into the program. I'll make white balance even warmer. Let's turn on mask preview. External LUT is making dark areas colder now. Current warm edit applies to bright areas. If you set the transition border between LUTs too hard, the transition from warm to cold colors in the image will also become noticeable. I will make the mask smoother. Here's before, here's after. I'll load another image. This is an underwater photo. I can further strengthen the effect of warm edit here. I'll increase white balance, then adjust the contrast. Make the picture even redder with tint slider and slightly increase the saturation. I'm going to swap LUTs to gain access to cold edit. I will also adjust contrast here. Here's a photo before, here's after. The difference is simply amazing, although the result was obtained in a minute. I have another underwater photo. Let's see how my color grading applies to it. Here's before, here is after. It looks amazing. That's all for today. See you in the next video.